Hello everyone, and welcome back to Atomic Society. We are going to restart our glorious settlement of Tortugaville. But we changed the map this time, so we're now in the forest. And it's rather lush looking compared to the other place we were at. There's even a lake in the middle here. But let's find a good place to set up our village before we unpause. Let's see, there's a structure there we can use. Hmm. We want something nice and big for our town hall. What's this? A human skeleton. Find a tattered page clutched to the skeleton's hand. Enemy. Oh, this is different than the other ones. Let's see. I think this is anyway. I don't think it said this. It says, enemy nations always agree to go to war. Now they've agreed on nuclear war. There's less than two months to the initial attack. I have all the evidence in my bag, but nobody to give it to. The press won't listen. The government hate me. And now I'm haunted. The shadows behind me are secret service. They want me dead despite their friendly smiles. They hate me even more than those in my home country. That one journalist must have sold me out. She seemed so welcoming, so believing. My message of collusion would be leaked out bit by bit through the internet. Oh, well, they had the internet before all this happened. I told her everything. I told her they'd claim it was a test gone wrong. Military generals turned rogue. A thermal nuclear missile will just so happen to land on one, one of the least populated cities in the country. Leaders will claim it's an act of war when they're shaking hands behind the scenes. If all this happens and someone finds this journal, please laugh with me. Laugh hard and long. Mankind is about to go up in flames. Maybe someone else can get the truth out if anybody survives. As for me, I give up. Seize the deed. I, oh, seize the day. Not the deed. My bad. I probably have a few hours until I'm shot and my body dragged into the middle of nowhere. Won't need money soon. Nobody will. I could buy anything I wanted now. That's definitely different. Sounds like maybe they were planning to go to nuclear war just for shits and giggles. There's not really a lot down over here. Let's see. There's a church. There's a boat. A boat. A boat, a boat. Let's see. No. Can we have more than one outpost? I, th I believe so. Actually, yes, I do. Yeah, you can. Okay. So, I think we'll initially set our thing up uh, over here. Uh, probably just use this. Maybe this one it looks like the other one we had initially. And then we can build down into here. And then there's stuff all around. And then once we have the ability to build outposts, we'll build an outpost over wherever that church is at. Uh, where's our group at? There they are. Actually, you know what? Let's set this up as the storehouse for our community, and we'll start building right here, because then we'll have a nice picturesque look at the lake. And there's metal there, probably. And we can build houses in among the trees. Or should we use this? Let's use this. Okay, we'll unpause this. Let's 
send our guys over there to build that. Man, we move, we haul ass to go do things. They're converting it to a storehouse for us. It will be the center of our town. Which will be wonderful. Oh, it actually looks like a little house. That's neat. I thought it was like, um, some sort of commercial building, but... Now we actually have something that looks like a proper town hall. That's that's kind of cool. <laughs> okay. So what do we need to build first? Uh, probably a well. Oh, we gotta go salvage shit first. Damn it. Uh, no, I just want to salvage. Go down there and salvage first. We're just going to run at quick speed here. While we salvage some things real fast. Because we need lump well, we need lumber, macery, we need literally everything. Okay, go deposit that crap. These people are just kind of meandering around. Because they're like, I don't know what to do. Can we build stuff now? Let's see. I do want to build a well. Um, we'll put it behind here. There we go. And then... We need metal to build a tenement? What the? What about the basic shack? The basic shack. Let's see, this is probably closer. Go over there. Initially, starting off is kind of slow. Because we gotta build all the stuff and then assign people to it, etc., etc. And we don't initially have a lot of storage capacity. So we have to keep going back and forth. Back and forth. There we go. Now some people have some jobs. We will build, uh, you know what, getting, um, let's build our farm and stuff up here. Can we build more than one of them? Green, that's not enough. Well, shit. We probably need an engineer's thing, too. Uh, where's that? Under repair shack. That's what we need. Builder's yard. Uh, let's build this next. And we don't have enough masonry? What the? In the first month, we're literally just running back and forth over here to salvage stuff. Lita's inventory is full. Yes, I know. We need to find the stuff to make... Okay, hang on. We're gonna... No, I don't want to pause it completely. Uh... No, 
let's send him to go salvage this real quick. I think that might be where the backpacks and that stuff are to increase. Um, builder's yard, there we go. Oh yeah, this will cover the area nicely. There we go. Where's our guy at? There he is. Why is he going that way? Why didn't he go this? Oh, he probably can't climb up over that. Man, he's got to go all the way around. Shit. This was probably a bad idea. You can salvage manually? How do we do that? I like how he's running sideways on a cliff. That's funny. I forgot we have to, we're just going to lock it in the night and at noon. It is noon. This wasn't worth it. Oh, we found something. All right. All right. Where the hell is our... We need to build latrines. Really, I forgot that was a that's a thing in this. Not enough resources. Well, I guess people are just gonna have to do your do your business wherever. Watch where he goes. He's gotta go all the way around this stupid lake. Really? Wow, this thing didn't have much storage capacity, did it? Shit. What storehouse is under? Um, there we go. Since people are complaining about latrines, since they don't want to just go on the ground, I mean... Put those 
goes right there. Um, let's keep sending them back and forth to this building over here, I guess. Serious diseases are spreading. Oh no. We'll build the we'll build a tenement right there. That'll at least get us some some of our people into some shelter. Oh, he was almost there. Cool. Tools. You can always use tools. All right. Military rations. What? Okay. We found a toolkit. Sweet. Go deposit that stuff. Because we need it. Inventory empty. Not for long, it's not. Alright. Uh, next thing we need to build is a repair shack. So we can keep our stuff for a pad. Oh, wait, no, never mind. I was like, we need people working at the storehouse? Since when? Getting on a build and roll here. There we go. Yeah. All right. We're getting established good now. Water supply is low. I don't have any canteens. I should probably build one. It under though. Trade shack. Mm -hmm. Oh, we don't have the ability to build them yet. I have to research it. So we'll build a tavern instead. How do we rotate stuff? I forgot. Probably a first aid tent would be a good idea. Um, let's see. Put it right there. There we go. 
Let's see, where's our... Oh, we have to have the town hall to do this crap? Okay. Hang on, I gotta look at the options real quick, because I don't remember... It's E. Q and E, what? Doesn't seem to make a lot of sense, but whatever. I'm building a damn tavern. That bugger off already. Shit. Ruin is empty. Let it dry. Shit. Go salvage that one then. Go, 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 go. Uh, we'll put a livestock ranch up here, too. There we go. This needs people. Good. There we go. Come back. Super. All right. Let's see. Ten of them will build it. No, oh, not enough. Oh, it needs two metal. Come on. <laughs> this game's kind of a pain in the... There's a dead person right in front of the storehouse. Nice. Uh, this game's kind of a pain in the in the backside right off the beginning. Tenement, there we go. I'll throw you down right there. What do we need for the town hall? Metal, okay. We'll have it here in a minute. Oh, really? Storehouses are all full. Oh my god. Well, we know we don't need all this lumber. There we go. What we do need is metal so we can build another storehouse. And we got it. Alright. Boost your abilities. Mouse over to see what you found. I help you search in the dark. Alright. Awesome. Okay, now we need to build another storehouse because that's a problem. I'm just going to have to build a whole bunch of freaking storehouses. And we don't have enough metal. That's good. Wait, what do we need for the trade shack? Metal. Damn it! Damn you, metal! This one thing is going to be a problem, isn't it? Too, so I mean, that's a good thing, I guess. Store at the nearest storehouse. Okay, there we go. So we are going to build the trade shack. We're going to 
put it right there. That way we can sell things for stuff we need. And take some of the crap we don't need. And get rid of it. Like a little shack just popped up out of the ground out of nowhere. That is kind of funny. the trade thing at. A trader has arrived. Shortly after building your trade shack, a limping man with a dirty beard wanders into your town, pushing a shopping cart. A small group of nomad children wearing filthy rags follow him at a distance. Each child carries a small sack of salvaged items. The contents of the trolley is covered in a plastic sheet and rattles. The trader gives a toothless grin and thanks you for building a trade outpost in your growing town. He tells you of his hopes that this latest town will last a while and be prosperous and ethical, unlike others he has seen come and go. He says the new trade shack will be able to increase the value of unwanted salvage by letting you exchange it for goods that his children acquire in the field. All you have to do is fill in a simple form to trade. He prefers to buy at bulk and always has time to help potential future leaders of the nation. You can now sell goods to the trader by opening the storehouse menu. Awesome. Also, the fact that he's using child labor, I mean, I don't know about that, but it is the apocalypse. So, much like in Frostpunk, I mean, we're going to have to just deal with it, I guess. I forgot how to do this now. Oh, there it is. Okay, so we need metal, so we will... Uh, metal, what do we have? Lumber. Let's see, old 25 get us. 15, all right. Ah, oh, come on. Lumber should be worth more than that, considering right now. <laughs> all right. Town hall established. We have. Oh man, we don't. We need more water. Okay. So let's build another well. Well, well, well. Uh, we'll build it right here. Food is uh, well. People are not happy with it, but. I mean, they should be happy with whatever prevents them from starving to death. Honestly, I mean, it's the apocalypse, folks. You gotta, you gotta make do with what you got. That probably sounds shitty, but 
Oh yeah, let's build a research center too. Build it up here on the mountain so everybody sees it. I don't want that area up there to be for my farms, though. That's for homes. We'll put it right there next to our town hall. That'll work great. Really, I need more latrines? Come on. I put it right next to your house. How's that sound? Uh, I don't want to put them in a spot where we're going to have to uh, worry about it being in the way of me expanding my homes. You guys get three more. Or two more. I'm sorry. I can't count tonight. Water supplies are low every time you guys complain about water supplies. It's just a constant thing with you guys. Even when they're good, you guys complain. Oh, we have a bunch of laws we can already enact. Okay, we'll look at this in a minute. Let's get people working here. What laws can we enact? Let's see. We have... Apparently people... This is... All, okay, so the way I understand this from the first time we played through it is if these come up, um, that means that this has already happened in, in, the, in your town. So we've had murder, prostitution, slavery. Oh, tisk tisk. Euthanasia. What? Vegetarians? They're not... How's vegetarians a problem? I, did, I don't get that from the previous play run through. Drug use. Patriotism. <laughs> this is... I didn't actually read these. It says, Some citizens feel so positive about this town, they're trying to convert others to your belief system to cheer them up. But sometimes this offends people so much that they leave town. What? You're, you're that upset about someone trying to convert you to a religious faith? You just go, ah, oh, screw this, I'm leaving. I'm out. Fuck this town. I'm done. I mean, you're in a nuclear wasteland. Where else are you going to go? So I think we'll deal with murder. And uh, how we will deal with it is we will execute the people that do it. Oh, we need the punishment center, though. Oh, let's deal with prostitution. Info station. We need stuff we don't have yet. That's good. Okay. Why is this not getting built? Also, we will build a chapel. Oh, wait, that's not the rotate button. There we go.
build it over here so these houses have it. So the people in the houses will have a chapel. And then we'll send our guy out to, or our town leader out to um, salvage more stuff. Okay, we get people working here first. Um, I think what we should do is research the canteen. This giant storehouse. Giant storehouse doesn't take as long. Weaponsmith. We don't need that. Let's go with giant storehouse first. Alrighty. Um. Well, right, we'll build one more storehouse. Oh, we don't have enough metal. That's good. That's cool. Okay, so we've depleted that ruin. That didn't take long. We get a lot of lumber out of that, won't we? Yep. Okay. Uh, let's see. What are we gonna build? I don't have canteen. Stop telling me that. I think we build the prison, we're gonna build it um, over here. No, that's too far away. Uh, build it up here by where our farms are gonna be. Is he done salvaging? Yeah. Okay. There we go. Do, 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 do. Well, food quality's going back up. That's good. Oh, excuse me. outside the repair area. Shit. Um, I guess we'll have to build another one over here. Repair shack. There we go. 
Okay, what else do we need to build? Um, let's build it. Oh, come on already. Good grief. You know what? There we go. Now we got metal for days. Hardy har har har. We'll actually build two of these. Uh, just because. Never hurts to have a lot of food. And, let's see. Put that right behind our town hall. There we go. We'll try and take care of everything at once. Uh, let's see, where should we send him next, though, so to salvage? Oh, it says there might be batteries in there. Once the punishment center's up and running, we can enact the thing about dealing with murderers, too. Masonry. Okay. Murder. Execute. You commit a murder, you're going to hang for it. The way it should be. Batteries. Wait, can we upgrade these things? No, we don't have any batteries. Okay. Oh, okay. We invent. We dropped off our inventory. <laughs> Return to the shipping container. Bleed it dry. We want batteries. Find batteries. Oh, there we go. Oh, we got two of them. Yes. Okay, what should we upgrade with the batteries? Uh, how many batteries does it take? Three. Damn. No salvage stuff. Don't repair shit. What? I didn't click on that. It takes three batteries to upgrade that. That's kind of ridiculous. Whatever. There we go. We got our first powered structure. Super duper.
No usable salvage left in sight. Okay. There he is, very slowly getting over there. Uh, I think that's empty too. Don't we have a strike? Yeah, let's go right here. See what should we build? Hang on, do we have a way to check to see? Let's see, manage your town beliefs. No stats. How many people are homeless? Eighteen. How many people can a tenement fit in it? Fifteen. Crap, we're gonna have to build like two of these. Okay. So we shall build two more of them. Maybe. One. Two. All right. Now, nobody will be homeless, so I don't have to hear any complaining from the people being like, Mayor, we don't have any homes. Salvaged medicine, what? I don't know if I'd trust that. Inventory full. All right, go deposit that stuff. Oh, we need to increase the speed so he gets up here faster. I forgot that we're running on normal speed. Did he deposit it? Empty, yes, excellent. We're only in the first year yet? Holy shit. We're only a year in, we've already built this. Well, we're not even a whole year in. We're three quarters of the way through it, and we've already built all of this. Impressive. Wait, we we don't have enough people to fill uh, to get people working at the chapel. This is crap.
I guess the people we had that were working at these things left. That's terrible. How could they? Wait, did that just say we had 80 lumber? Hang on. Hang on, hang on. We what? How do we have 80 lumber? What the f Okay, we're gonna build something else. Let's see, in enforcer outpost. Ooh. Mm -hmm. We should probably build more latrines so you don't complain to me about this. Last thing I need is to get complained at again. Livestock ranch. Throw that right there. A research project is complete. Oh, good. Now we can build the large storehouses. Excellent. Giant storehouse. Yeah. That's what we wanted. We'll throw it up here by the prison. Okay, now we will research the canteen. Where is it? Where is it? Yes. Oh, we can enact a new social issue. What should we enact? We need the prison for this. Maybe we should just beat them severely. Let's see, uh... Well, I like how it has advisors advising us on what to do here. It says, uh, the first advisors take them to the punishment center and flog them. A weapon is quick, cheap, and it'll probably teach them a lesson. Though we might need to patch them up afterwards. Moderately decreases how often this issue occurs. What happens if we just execute them for doing it? Significantly decreases... The dead people can't commit the same crime twice. <laughs> I say we just give them a severe beating. I'd rather not have to kill a bunch of people because they're doing something that, uh, um, well, yeah. Giving them a severe beating is not as bad as hanging them. We're trying to grow a population, not shrink it. Let's see, is this empty? No, go back down there and salvage out of it. What's this over here? Is this a building? Oh, it's a playground. Okay. There's a building there. This map is definitely more colorful than the other one was. Oh, I heard that noise. That means he's salvaging something. I 
boy hasn't even gotten her yet. The leader's inventory is full. Okay, we'll return. Alright, well we deposited our stuff, so I think this would be a good place to uh, leave off for the moment. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and end this video here at the moment. If you guys have been enjoying my videos, though, so far, please go ahead and do hit the like and subscribe buttons. Because then that way I know what you guys like, what you don't like, and what to do more of in the future. Also, don't forget to ring the notification bell. That way, you always know when I go live or I upload new videos. Thank you for watching, everyone. I will see you all in the next video. But until then, you all have an awesome time.